How's it going everybody? My name is Salty and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at my number one AK-47 class setup here in Black Ops Cold War. Now, first and foremost, I'm going to need you guys to make sure you hit that subscribe button for me so you don't miss any of my daily Call of Duty videos. And then make sure you also smash the like button if you find at any point this video is informative, helpful, or you just enjoy watching the gameplay as a whole. That would be much appreciated. Let's jump into it. Now, this particular class setup is the one from my top five assault rifles video. If you guys haven't seen that, make sure you guys go check that out where I cover the top five assault rifles here in Black Ops Cold War. This is the identical class. So for some of you, this is going to sound a bit repetitive. But for everyone that has not seen that video, you're going to need the brute suppressor here for vertical recoil control, and the overall ability to stay off the map hidden from your enemies. We have the reinforced heavy barrel for both effective damage range and bullet velocity. Down to the underbarrel, you need the Spetsnaz grip here for the overall horizontal recoil of the weapon. This will help your cause a ton. For the magazine, the 40 round mag to not sacrifice any aim down sight speed, but still have that ability to aim down sight quickly. If you were to go with a larger mag, you're going to be sacrificing some aim down sight speed here. Then for the stock, the KGP Skeletal. This helps with your sprint to fire speed and then also your aim walking movement speed. I'm not going too in depth on this class setup because like I said, it's in that top five video. I'm going to have it linked down in the comment section for you guys so you guys can go take a peek at it if you guys want to learn more about the weapon and why I'm using these attachments. We got banger gameplay for you guys where we get a nuclear. We're going to jump into that now. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, we're using the AK-47 from my top five assault rifle video. Uh, this thing hits like an absolute truck. I really slept on this weapon. And it's a shame because it'd probably be my most used AR. As of right now, the... I believe the FFAR is? The FFAR before it got nerfed. This kid's got freaking marshals. Trash can. Yeah, I'm gonna target that kid all game. Anybody who sits there and uses the marshals doesn't deserve to be. Okay, I'm not rechalling. Hello. I understand using the marshals as a secondary, like completely, I do. But people who run around with them, like this guy as a main, please, please stop. Stop playing the game. It's embarrassing. And now I'm completely off topic with what I wanted to talk about, just strictly because of, of the kid. I, I'm sorry, there's no place for, for that kind of, kind of garbage. There's a kid in... Right there. I, I apologize. I'm completely off topic now. And I lost my train of thought. What do you guys think of the marshals, though? Do you think people who use the marshals are, are in the right, I suppose? Or do you think that it's a little it's a little cheesy? Because just my personal opinion, I, I can't think, think of a better word other than cheesy. As you guys can see, I can really control the middle of the map here. Medium range is, is uh, the AK-47's bread and butter. I, I said it in my top five ARs. I don't, I don't think there's a better weapon at medium range. Just personally, that is. I really enjoy using this weapon now that I gave it a true and solid chance. Kids, get, the kid's going for B. I give him a lot of credit there. This is playing very slow. Assaulting with war machine. We'll hit this just because I don't know where I'm supposed to be looking. Right, we gotta get here. Then we'll have a guy in here. This is a very slow paced uh, affair. Not a fan. I'm sure you guys know that I'm a very fast paced player. Definitely prefer for kids to be moving around the map. Trying to play the objective, that is. This kid wants to go this way too. You just made a mistake here, pal. Okay, we're not gonna stay there. I'm gonna go to the heady here. This is the Marshall kid. I'm gonna need him to come out. Both are going that way. Come on in. Thank you. We got a spy plane here. We should get a nuke. We should. I'm not gonna jinx it. I've died off so many nukes today. I've almost gone crazy in a way. Right 
27. 28. Lucky isn't even the right terminology for what just happened to me. Hey, he got him on that head glitch. There's a guy over there. There's a nuke. Should be a guy pushing right here. Unless he turned around. I think he did. Might have turned around. I think that was the second kid I killed. Okay, you know what? Good shot. Good shot. Uh, I'm just gonna hit the nuke now. F it. Possibility of me going for another one now, now that I hit it. I'm all for it. Okay, so we're 38 and two. The game is extremely slow paced, probably because I believe I saw two snipers and a sniper rifle, so. When you combine those all together, that does not equal a fast-paced other team. My team's done a very good job of controlling the map. The wind's Enemy down. Their yeah, I mean, we made it to middle map. This team has zero interest. Zero interest in the objective anymore. There was the one kid, and I think that's the one that just left. Come on, man. You just got nuked and you're still going to use marshals. I just don't understand. I don't understand. I never will understand, I suppose. Securing Alpha. Losing B. All right, 42 and 3 at the half. All right, if you guys have made it this far into the video, just top, in the comment section, AK is overpowered, AK-47 is overpowered, AK is OP, you know, any of the variants of what I just said, or make up your own, just something about AK-47 being just absolutely disgusting. I'm hoping here in the second half that the other team decides that they want to win the game or something because it's, it's a little boring, quite truthfully. It's boring when, when they don't want to even try to win. Oh my gosh. They're all on B. Okay. You know what? Good for you guys. You guys got B. I, I envy that effort there. I take back what I said. You kids, you guys did... Good job. I feel bad for them because we have a kid in our team with a street sweeper, L. Don't main shotguns, please. Shotguns are extremely just unfair to use. I understand they're in the game, but... Just my opinion, I don't think they have a place in Call of Duty. Good shot, actual. Good shot, Fat Daddy. Let's see, M60. M60 hits so hard, I can't wait to make a video on that. If you guys are interested in an M60 video, for sure, in the comment section, just... M yes, I want to see an M60. Yeah, do an M60 class, something like that. I almost feel cheesy using this AK-47. It's so broken. I'm surprised no one really talked about it. Like, let's be real here. It didn't have that much attention. The AK-47 really didn't have that much attention. Everybody knew it was, like, a good weapon. Like, But they never really put it on a pedestal, like other metas, I suppose. And let's be honest, the LC-10, the Tech-9, the AK-74U, the FFAR in the beginning of the game's life cycle, the XM-4 before the nerf, every every metal weapon had like a pedestal. Arming this one never did, and I don't understand why. It's not like they've touched it too much. There, there's nothing really to say about it. Okay, so I also need to know what other top five, um, top five stuff you want. Because it's, uh, 
I really enjoy making those videos because they seem very informative. I feel like I'm informing people of the of the best weapons you can be using. I was thinking of a top five off meta weapons. I thought that was a kind of a good idea. And I'd love to hear your opinions about that as well. Because no one really talks about off metas or off meta classes, anything like that. And personally, I think that would be a very creative idea on my part. I'm just running around this map like it's my playground. Because that's exactly what it is. Slums is my playground. I love slums. I was gonna say one thing that's not happening. They're not about to make a comeback on me. That's not an ideal. It's not what I'm looking to, looking to do here. I'm looking to win the game. Kid just stuck me with a grenade. Ugh. Oh, I can't wait to go to bed. I've been up for a while. I gotta work for the next couple days. So I'm recording all these videos. If you guys didn't know, I record my videos. Uh, all in like a day, like uh, for the week I try to do, if uh, on my days off, I get two days off a week from work, I try to get all my videos done in those two days. Sometimes it doesn't work out that way because I also have to record for Facebook, but 92.7 with our nuke, that's our AK-47, GG's. If you guys enjoyed the video, if you could make sure you hit that like button for me, that'd be absolutely awesome. If you're new to the channel, make sure you also smash that subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.